Today was the day for the Foot Fantasy promo in FIFA Ultimate Team with some absolutely insane players included. Not the most original cards, but there are some absolutely insane cards. And today I'm going to be discussing the possible Foot Fantasy mini release that will be coming Sunday at 6pm most likely. Getting into the video, we did see this morning EA accidentally somehow managed to change Ericsson's gold cards to his Foot Fantasy even before the promo came out. So I had two in my quick sell pile, but they did bug, so you couldn't actually use him or sell him. Before you were able to sell him for 10k, but then they patched it. But we still haven't seen EA say anything about that yet, which is very weird. And this is how the cards do upgrade. So they do change color as well, which is pretty cool. And they have a little border when they upgrade. Three appearances in the next five games, that gets a plus one. If they get a win in the next five games, they get another plus one. And if an attacker or midfielder gets a goal or assist or a defender or goalie gets a clean sheet in the next five games, they get another plus one. So it's three possible upgrades, which is really insane. Just imagine St. Maximin as a 95 rated striker in this game. His 92 is currently extinct at 3 million coins. I don't even want to think how good this 95 is going to be. Same with Kamavinga, his 87's here, but he could be getting upgraded to 90 rated. So watch out when you're selling these players. If you pack them, you may want to keep hold of some of them. Unfortunately, there won't be any token system in this promotion, and the game's counting towards the upgrades won't start until the 1st of April which is quite a while away it's like two weeks away there were some changes in the leak team this is the leak team we got last night and then this is the updated one we got a few hours before 6 p.m with a few changes but the first objective card that was leaked was La Celso he'll be coming in team two with a decent looking card if I think the stats are official on this one he gets good links with that Avila foot birthday and a lot of other cards in the game Caliguri is getting a SBC card now he I don't think will cause enough hype in my opinion he's good for a 3-5-2 but I don't see many people playing that he gets a green link with Oxford but there's not many other green links he gets but the mini release has been leaked here as you can see Keita Balde, Lucas Moura and Core are going to be in the mini release most likely Sunday at 6pm you haven't seen a Saturday one in ages now this Keita Balde card looks pretty good but the links on him are very poor unfortunately so I think the only link that people would use is Di Natale's hero card. He looks good, so I think that partnership could be a decent one, but I don't think he'll be too expensive. Lucas Moore, on the other hand, will be very expensive. As you saw of his Winter Wild card, that card is very hyped up, and this is even better. I know it's not central, which is a bit worse, but the card is better, so he'll be very hyped. With links to players like Firmino as well, that's going to be insane. Core looks like a very usable CDM. I don't think he'll be too expensive either because he's so low rated, but I think it's a very good card. And he gets green links with a lot of players like Klosterman's card he got today at 6pm, which is a very good centre-back. And the last player who I think could sneak into this mini release is Pedro. He was leaked to be in this promo, not as an SBC or an objective by leakers. So he could be the fourth man in this mini release, but that's not confirmed. And he links to that Brahim Diaz feature stars if you manage to complete his SBC. Let me know down below if you guys are hyped for this promo. I kind of am. It's not that original, but I'm enjoying it so far. If you haven't already joined the FIFA Discord, the link is in the description. But I'll catch you guys in the next one. It's Beanfoot Master and I'm out. Peace.